Hey everyone, welcome back to another YouTube video. Uh, I recorded a video and um, I don't know why the audio didn't work and I, I tried very long to fix it, but I figured I don't, I'm not a tech whiz, so uh, kind of a treat. And uh, Russell, this one's for you, uh, Weasley12. Uh, I think that's how you say your name. Correct me if I'm wrong, sorry if I butchered it, but every time I see your comments, uh, I love you brother, for all the comments and uh, likes and views that you give me. It's the cyclist that's on fire, so I recognize you all the time. And um, thank you for calling me out, saying there's no sound. I, I don't know what happened. Anyways, uh, there was an unboxing and uh, it's already unboxed or unpackaged, so I figured I would do a video, kind of a special treat, a little bit of a longer video here, but go through all my PSAs that I have and uh, kind of just chat about random stuff in general because that's what we do here. Uh, I've made it simpler, <laughs> like I have two in here. Kind of when I set out to do my collection here, uh, I, I didn't have the ambition to collect all of the PSA of the 1990 Marvel Impel cards. I figured I would just do the heroes. And like, yeah, it's just kind of what I did from like my comic book collecting. Sorry, what I learned from my comic book collecting is like, just get the superheroes. Villains just don't have the same flair. People just don't like them. I don't know, but um, yeah, there's still a few that I want to pick up. So uh, first was Captain America, Black Suit Spider-Man. I love AF, A, uh, ugh, ASM 252, the cover swapped AF-15. Uh, love that comic. I should get more, I think it's underpriced, but anyways, Daredevil. Only have one. Nick Fury, only have one. Miss Marvel. This one, cool story is these these were rare. I think the population used to be 10%. Now probably it's closer to 15. Uh, this one used to go for like, gosh, in like the 500s. And then a few of these popped up. You can see I got a few. A few of these popped up for like 150 bucks. So I just went on a shopping spree. Kind of regret it now in some sense because... Uh, I don't know, the artwork is just okay. Marvel Girl and Jean Grey. And uh, so now I have five of them. <laughs> this is, uh, yeah, anyways. It's collecting, I guess you can say. Hoarding might be the other way to say it. <laughs> Wolverine. I thought this, uh, this was the most expensive Wolverine card in the set. Although, I've said this many times, I like the Yellow Suit one a bit better. It's kind of like the OG. No Wolverine. Dazzler. I don't know if you guys have heard of the whole rumors about Taylor Swift coming as Dazzler. I don't know. It's like a, Taylor Swift's kind of too big for Disney, in my opinion. Uh, it'd be awesome just because Dazzler was a musician and Taylor Swift is probably our, our era's Madonna, if I could say. But uh, yeah, she's not a big character unless they shift the whole X Men theme, so, sorry, X Men show around Dazzler instead of Kitty Pride. And I know the cartoon was about Jubilee. So, hey, maybe like the cartoon did it all about Jubilee. Whereas in the X-Men comics, it's all about Kitty Pride as like the young new X-Men. So we'll see. I don't know. Uh, Thor. Iceman. I probably picked up one too many Icemen. I have three of them. This one here, this is the Wolverine one that I like. Let's see how many I have. Oh, I have. Oh, whoa. I had no idea that I picked up so many of these. So I have uh, one, two, three, four, five. I have six of these. That is a little bit too much. But I think this cover, this card, this Wolverine card just looks awesome. What do you guys think here? This one versus... This one. What do you guys think? Do you guys agree with me or disagree with me? Isn't this one cooler? An after and shot? This one's Wolverine just kind of standing there. This other claw's not even popped yet. There's Wolverine action jumping in. So that's kind of like the OG suit. I really hope that when X-Men comes to the MCU that he comes out in the yellow suit, not in that brown or like the weird black fox costume that they gave. Um, Anyways, we won't get into that. Storm, Oro Monroe, Ororo, sorry, or Ororo. Shadowcat, uh, Shadowcat, I don't know, whoa. Shadowcat, I don't know why I got so many. 
Uh, I'm still looking for Lockheed. Not a very popular character. I just think Lockheed's kind of cool. Lockheed kind of was, I wouldn't say Shadow Cat's pet. Um, Lockheed hung out with Shadow Cat a lot and also with Magic. Uh, Moon Knight, who nobody cares about anymore. I watched most of the Disney Plus show, but then I never finished it. It was just kind of boring. I never was into Moon Knight. So, yeah, anyways. Uh, the Herald of Galactus, Silver Surfer. This is the other Wolverine. This is called Wolverine Patch. Uh, it's kind of like Wolverine number one, the continuing series. Eh, this one's not worth a lot, nor is it highly sought after. I, honestly, this reminds me, who remembers uh, Wolverine 2099, or I think that was what it was called. Well, maybe it wasn't. I forget. Anyways, he has one arm where it's like some laser that shoots out because Cyclops like burned his arm off and the Cyclops has one eye. Let me know if you guys remember that. Fellow calling out the fellow X-Men nerds out there. Uh, Nightcrawler, cool thing about this card, not this one specifically, but Nightcrawler was actually the first card I had in the series. I had it even before I bought any of this, the individual cards. Uh, just something cool about this card. When I was young, I loved it. I had a big ass crease in the middle, so I really had to go and pick up some PSA 10s on that. Uh, Rogue, I don't know why I picked up so many Rogues, but um, I was kind of excited for her parents in the Marvels. I hope i'm still very hopeful praying that they have sort of like a closing after credit scene where they show like a glove on top of a chair or something to signify that that would i'd just be happy if i saw that beast i want to get another beast uh beast is beast is underrated i think he's uh, one of the cool characters i loved him in astonishing x-men series where he was starting to get more like a cat um yeah good character he's funny um yeah, it says the beast conceals beneath his brutish exterior the mind of a brilliant scientist. Yeah, beast is cool. Storm, this is the uh, other variant Storm. This one's actually quite rare and hard to find, uh, but I ended up snatched two of them. This one is my first villain, Magneto. This one, I, if you've watched my other videos, you'll know I wanted to get this one. And I got the Brotherhood of Evil Mutants one because I wanted this one. And he's kind of in the center with, with Wanda and Quicksilver on the side. I ended up getting that one. I sold it for a good price. But um, yeah, anyways, this is, a, this is an awesome looking card. I really like this one. I want to pick up one more of these. It's just like, it looks great. I love this. Like PSA 10, I'm very happy with this one. This is an old label. It doesn't have the uh, logo, the hologram here. And uh, yeah, I don't know if, if, if you guys, if you guys, I don't know too, too much about PSA as much as like CGC and CPS comics. Look at this. They used to be a public company, CLCT. They're, I think they went private now. If you guys know, let me know in the comments below. Like, can I send this back to this PSA to get reholdered? Uh, how much does that cost? I mean, I can just Google it, but um, is it worth doing? Is it not worth doing? What do you guys think? The corners... Oh, this corner looks a little bit. Oh, well, yeah, it's not not mint, but it's nice. Shadow Cat is the other villain I got, just because Shadow Cat is she really a villain? Mm, I mean, sure, she's a thief. She's a thief. AF fifteen, arguably the best Marvel comic. Love that cover. Fantastic Four, I'm not a huge FF fan, but I bought this just because, yeah. X-Men number one. Now this, I still need to get the actual X-Men number one. I I keep eyeing it and uh, one day, one day I'm gonna get one. That's that's kind of my goal. I've been saving money. I haven't been spending too, too much recently. And um, it's, 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 on my, it's on my to buy list. GSX, John Size X-Men. Uh, another wicked cover, first appearance of quite a few of the new X-Men, Nightcrawler, Colossus, Storm. I guess you can say Wolverine. Uh, this is when he joins the X-Men, but GSX is not his first appearance. It's Hulk 181, which is actually what my original video was coming up soon. Wolverine, 
I have this comic in uh, Newstand. Yeah. And here we go. Two of them. Love this cover. So much action in the shot. One to go in the back. I'd be happy, honestly, if they didn't do this MVC and just had the, this go out without this green in the uh, other whatever. Kind of like these ones. Well, I guess, sorry, that has that border too. Just makes it look really small. X-Men, this is considerably the first card, a rookie card appearance of Psylocke and Jubilee. Uh, I think Forge, Strong Guy, and Gambit as well, because these guys are not a set. Rogue has her card, and maybe Banshee as well. I think Havoc is in the set. Storm, of course, as Wolverine is. But yeah, <laughs> look at Gambit. Uh, rumors also that he's coming to MCU very soon. Uh, he might be in Deadpool, so fingers crossed we'll see. I don't know if it's Chan Chan and Tatum or someone else, but yeah. Here's the other X-Men card. Here are the other accents. I wish they did it like the different teams where Storm's team, like the blue team and the gold team. Uh, Cyclops, the leader of hmm, the blue team? I hope I'm right. <laughs> anyway, Jean Grey looks really stupid there. There's Wolverine, Shadow Cat, Rogue, Nightcrawler, Colossus. It doesn't make sense. Like, I, I don't know. I don't know why when they're doing this, they had like Strong Guy is like an X Force, isn't he? Uh, and Banshee and Havoc. I don't know. Like I, I'm curious why when they drew these, they did these two X-Men team team photos. The back both have the the headquarters of the mansion. Oh, interesting. So this one says the former former headquarter the x mansion and this one is headquarter the x mansion uh, je ne sais pas. and we got the man himself stanley daredevil uh spider-man Cap America, Fantastic Four down here, Flaming Torch, Invisible Women Thing, Mr. Fantastic. Mm, I don't know who that hat is. Thor's little, oh, Thor Captain America. Maybe Thor, Doctor Strange jacket. I think the green, maybe Hulk. I'm not 100% sure who this hair is here. Um, this white, I doubt it's Silver Surfer. Oh, Iceman, mm, maybe, maybe. Is Iceman that big? I don't know. Yeah, let me you guys know if you know who that hat is from. So, anyways, and then very randomly, this Justin Hubert, uh, I bought something, Iceman, and he sent me the wrong card. And I asked him to send me an address to return it, and he never did. I called eBay, and eBay said, it's yours so i have this posted on sale i don't watch nfl so this is kind of the vessel that i keep these guys in so that's pretty much it uh seems like a lot but honestly just going through them with you guys it's been 14 minutes and i've gone through all the cards i did stack them in twos so you see that yeah so you can tell here that's three three one nuts that yeah so anyhow uh that's all i just want to share that's my psa 10 collection i am still looking for a colossus archangel uh one more magneto and uh yeah i just want to pick those up and um probably gonna be done like in terms of my psa 10 uh Marvel collection cards 
it's starting to get to a lot, I guess you can say. I've been selling a few of my comics here and there. Like you saw the last episode of my last video about Rocket. I was really sad. It's a totally cool guy. We chat all the time now, uh, text message. So kudos to him to buy that nice comic. But yeah, let me know if you guys are uh, still actively collecting. Prices have come down hugely. Like looking at my collection here, uh, I if I somehow thought about doing it now instead of when I did, I probably would have saved quite a bit of money, but I guess that's part of collecting. And um, yeah, so that's pretty much it. gonna wrap it up. Um, excited for the Marvels, just because I wanna see Rogue and very excited about Deadpool because uh, Wolverine and maybe Gambit. So we'll see. Cool guys, uh, thanks again for watching. Sorry for the first, Russell, sorry for that first video that had no sound, I don't know what happened. Can fix it. I'm too dumb to do that. So I thought I'd share with you my whole collection. So there we are. Have a wonderful, enjoy the rest of the weekend, and we'll see you guys next time.